Kia ora, welcome back. We're just going to um, carry on and we need to uh, put the door and the return in box 2. Um, so we already know where point 0.4 is, so we can just use that uh, and create the little box um, to subtract from the wall and then uh, we need to then find point 0.7 to do the return. So let's jump in and figure out um, or add the box into there. So we know where point 0.4 is uh, and we then need to draw uh, a new rectangle from there. So we did that. What's that one? Let's just turn that back on. Uh, where is that? What is that plane? Um, a good little handy uh, hint or trick is um, when you're not sure what piece you're looking at. Let's just bring this up here. Uh, that might be... So I don't quite know. That might be the return, I think. 0.6 it probably is. But we can come up over to this little uh, toolbar here. And the one with the green. So only draw preview geometry for selected objects. So we can click on that. And then you can start to see which bits are which. So even if they're previewed off, um, uh, we can see which one. So we actually want this one. So we can come and uncheck that. Uh, and um, we'll start with this. So if we do that and start to drag and push down Option or Alt and bring that down here. Uh, and let's put this back to uh, the top view so we can see what's going on. Uh, we just need a different plane so that's the point 0.4 uh, here we go is point 0.4 so we can drag that and put that in um, so we've got that now somewhere but I've got a feeling it's going to be in the wrong direction let's just turn some bits off because it confuses things and then even let's just jump up here preview that off and then we can preview this back on so you can see here um, let's just turn this on preview on um, that it's sort of in the wrong direction in both ways so we're going to need to put some negative uh, things in it's just Just put it well. I didn't want to do that. Um, put in a negative, and then uh, copy that and paste that. So we've got two. So we need this to go negative x and negative y, um, and we know those dimensions. So we've got door width. Um, so that's a negative x, so we can take our door width, make that negative, and put that into the x. So that's now going the right way. And then the wall uh, thickness, we want to go in a negative uh, distance as well. So we just need to bring that down, and then put that into the negative side. So we've got that, and then we can just take that back up. Uh, into our extrude so I'm going to do that hold down shift and put that into our extrude um, that's the sort of wall extrude um, and that's also subtracting out so we've now um, just do that we've got our other door set in there bring that up so you can see we've cut that door in there so we just need to put the return in let's go back to the plan so we now need um, to figure out where point 0.7 is so um, 
potentially we could just draw a new point and then bring it across um, we know the setback uh, and then the door width will get us on the ground plane so let's uh, do that so construct point um, so we want to move up the setback in the y direction and we want to do the door width but we need to do that as a negative in the x so let's do the negative first so connect that in and then we want where are we uh, door width so we can bring that down here Ooh, come on into there uh, and then we need this setback which we've got here so we can bring that down into the Y I don't know if we zoom in on this we can see now that we've got that point so we can draw our little rectangle that we set up before let's just see if we can remember where that is uh, I think it's up here somewhere uh, zoom out uh, point 0.6 will be that one so it'll be this one so we can just copy that down where are we let's see this one so we can Control C and Control V, bring that down. Uh, it's previewed on. Ooh. So we can set that start point that we just created into there. Uh, if we come into here, you can see that we've got that return, but it, again, it's and it needs to be made negative in both both ways. So. Um, Let's put a couple of negatives in. Negative, negative. So we want to take, uh, let's see, have to think about this. So we've got this return. So we've got a negative wall thickness in the x direction. So where's our wall thickness? Is there? Bring down, just keep going down, holding it down, so negative that. Um, we could probably pull some of these actually. Uh, those are different dimensions. Let's just do a new one here, keep it simple. So that's the X. And then we need our return length, and we need that to be negative as well and see how that goes yes so now we've got that in the right place so that's just a plane so we can see that in the perspective view there uh, so we need to just extrude that up uh, into uh, that's the outside wall and we want to keep that so that's the top one up there let's just rather than have that all the way up there let's bring these down to there makes it a little bit easier we can take that and holding down shift because otherwise we'll lose all the other ones put that in and then you can see we've now got those two elements and again it's probably a good idea to save so i'm going to save um, in grasshopper so you can see the little stars gone and i'm going to do that in rhino so i've just clicked in rhino and you can see it's edited and if i push s or control command s or control s it will save it right so we've got these things let's just bring these over and line them up probably turn those off so preview off and just tidy some of these bits up uh, bring that in there let's that makes it a bit neater we've got all those in a line um, a little bit messy in places but 
that's all right it's also helping you guys i'm gonna just bring these over to get those in line all of those can then be in a line Ooh, do that better nicer right so we've got most of it we don't need that on preview that off so where are we at now we've done a bit of a tidy up uh, we've got the two elements so all we've got left are these window cuts or slots uh, and the door in the middle so let's just sort of figure out before we get too far what's next um, let's uh, do the two slots next and then we'll finish with the, the door so i'll see you shortly